Good morning, everyone, and thank you for joining us today. We're going to talk about Retirement Boss Radio, a great subject. We've got a lot to talk about today. Uh, my name is Steve Murray. I'm the president here at Insurance Agency Marketing Services. Our guest speaker, of course, is going to be Dave Pemper. Dave is the president of Lazarus Coaching, the developer, developer of Retirement Boss Radio. We're seeing some great results in, uh, in a relatively uh, efficient uh advertising environment right now for uh, radio so i know that you're going to want to tune in have a uh, sit back and get some great information from the coach dave pimper as we get started i just want to mention a few things to you and i'm going to buzz through these rather quickly because i want to get to the main event but i want to make sure uh, just looking at our group here that you're all aware of our uh, new producer builders these are programs that we have available for folks that have just joined iams and is, are doing their production this is counts in all your production your first 180 days you get a kind of a little bit of a of a, a bonus on steroids so uh, look at what you have available to you and then keep in mind that if you're doing something else or you want to try something different uh, that uh, maybe doesn't appear on here, we're uh, certainly glad to do a custom uh, build for you on that to help you get your business going. You'll also notice that at the 750 level, uh, we will get you set up and get you rolling uh, on uh, uh, in Retirement Boss Radio. So uh, if you have, have interest in any of those and you're already, uh, you're recent with us and already in production, certainly speak with your uh, sales director. A couple other things we do to help you with kind of the grow, growth part of your business is our referred producer program and our marketing reimbursement program. These are two programs designed to put money in your pocket for things that you already uh, are interested or uh, maybe already biased towards doing. Obviously the uh, Referral program is a, the, on the basis on which IMS has built our business over the past 35 years now. Uh, and so the past six or seven, eh, probably a little bit longer than that now, more like eight or nine at this point, uh, we have had a, this rewards program in place. It's a pretty simple program. If you refer someone and they do business with us, we're going to pay you a bonus based on the business they do for as long as they do it. Those checks add up to some pretty good size numbers. And remember that that is nothing taken away from your uh, referee. Uh, your referee is, is somebody who can avail all the benefits that are available to you. Uh, also, you don't have the normal uh, liability that you might have with a subagent where if there's a chargeback or anything like that, it would inure back to you. That is not the case with the uh, referred producer program. Marketing reimbursement, again, is a very straightforward program. When you do business, we put money in your marketing reimbursement account. When you do business or when you are doing marketing, uh, simply send us receipts. We'll match your uh, spend dollar for dollar. So take advantage of both of those programs. I don't know how many of you are doing e-apps. We have built on our system what we call a single sign-on for the most common e-app solution in the industry, and that's called Firelight. So what that means is you can go on our website and access uh, applications via the e-app system for most of the carriers that you do business with. And the advantage of that is, of course, you only have to go to one website, which, you know, if you're like me, you have trouble remembering all those usernames and passwords uh, and where to find stuff. And so that's kind of one advantage. The second advantage is that if you're doing an uh, application with two carriers on the same individual, you can do a little cut and paste of information across, send it to your client, get approval, uh, get their sign off on it, and you're off to the races. It's a really professional and easy way for you to do business. And of course, then that information is available to you uh, going forward within the Firelight system. So handy, handy way to do business. I've, I can't tell you how many folks that we do business with that have converted to the EF system that uh, don't know why they waited to do that. It's pretty easy to do if you want to walk, talk with your sales director and he'll walk you through, he or she will walk you through about a four minute process to get registered. It's really, really easy to get registered on our website. We've got an advertising, your advertising team here. We call it the Creative Marketing Solutions Department. I want you to think of them more as your advertising team. Uh, they work, uh, the advantage, of course, of working with this advertising team as opposed to going outside and work with an advertising team down the street from you is that, that all that they do all day long is work with folks just like you, building their business uh, through helping folks in the insurance and securities, retirement planning, uh, Medicare SUP, life insurance. That's all that they do all day long. So they've got some great ideas ideas for you, very sp specific to our uh, uh, industry, and they are going to handle it very efficiently. They're gonna, we're going to do what we can on a pro bono basis. Everything else we're going to do kind of at our cost, and it's not a profit center for us here at IAMS at all. Of course, the way that we make money is when you make money, and the way that you make money is when people see you out and about 
uh, whether it's on a billboard, whether it's hearing you on the radio, whether it's seeing you on a Facebook post, however that happens, radio, TV, uh, newspaper, uh, direct mail. And so what we want to do is help you with that and make it as easy, as cost effective and efficient in your time as possible. And that's what they do. So if you need some help with any of that, any of what you see before you, give your sales director a call and have them walk you through the process. Retirement Analyzer, I always like to keep this slide on my presentations because I think it's such a great tool and we make it available to our producers at no cost. So uh, if you went out to, to subscribe to this service on your own, you're probably spending 70, 80 bucks a month. Uh, we're going to make it available to you at no cost. Call Marcus uh, here in our office or email Marcus at Marcus at IamsInc.com. That's M-A-R-C-U-S. I'll send you a chat with that information shortly. But if you want to have a look at the Retirement Analyzer, and you can see before you on the screen some of the things that you can do, but what you can't see is how beneficial that can be was you're building your relationship with a client. I would recommend, I mean, it's not, a, it's not an easy, uh, it's not a quick and easy process. So to put the information in that you need to get the right information out to be valuable to your client, you're probably looking at spending a little bit of time. So I would, I, I would try one out, maybe do one on yourself, do one on one of your top clients or one of your most dependable clients and say, hey, you know, how is this something that is valuable? Uh, maybe it's a question you ask yourself or if you want to ask the client, is this something that is valuable to you? Because what it will do is help them kind of see based on where they are today and where they want to be in retirement or 15 or 18 or 20 years down the road, how they're doing on that journey. It really puts in a nice, nice graphic format for them. So uh, give Marcus a call and have him give you a uh, sign on for it. Try it out. See if it's something that is uh, valuable to you at all. If it is, then uh, as long as you're doing business with us, we're going to keep it available to you uh, for, for the foreseeable future at, at our expense. So really nice feature, really nice benefit of doing business with IMS. I wanted to take a minute and I just want to see. Give me just one second here. Um, so, um, we work with a gentleman out of South Carolina and he does some great work for us on Facebook and he also does some great work for us on getting the media set up for our retirement bus radio and Dave's going to spend some more time telling you about Jared but I want to tell you how important that is to have the right person working for you there uh, with a lot of experience that knows what to ask for and knows what he can get and knows where to push the envelope and right now uh, given kind of the issues that many advertisers uh, are not advertising as much on radio right now because of the, the pandemic, you know, there's some great deals to be had. And I mentioned kind of earlier at the outset how the efficiency is greater. That's really why. So we were able to get the times, generally speaking, for a little bit less than we would. And Dave is going to talk to you a little bit about what his results have been, but his results have been higher than what he was normally experiencing outside the pandemic. So this is a particularly timely subject. And Dave will tell you a little bit more about Jared and his team down in South Carolina. Good morning, Dave. How are you today? I am wonderful. How are you doing, Steve? Good. You sound chipper. You, uh, I know you've been busy. You have a lot of appointments lately, and that's a that's a great thing. But I know that can get you a little bit run down. But you sound like you're on top of your game as always this morning. No, I am. I tell you, I had a. Uh, it's interesting. I had a. I had an appointment, and it, and it's just how timely Retirement Boss Radio is. But I had an appointment yesterday at a late appointment okay so it was actually a five o'clock appointment didn't get done till about 20 to 7 in omaha last night but she has available 1.3 million and it was from retirement boss radio and that was a first appointment well it, 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 i didn't set a second appointment but it was a very very good appointment and i just got off of a second appointment for seventy eight thousand dollars and um this one, I, I, I never want to say it's a layup, but 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 I will get this one. And that came from Retirement Boss Radio. The thing is, between seminars and Retirement Boss Radio and my book of business, the the goal is to to have continual and continuous appointments every day. That that's what you're trying to do. And I can handle up to about four appointments a day. That, that seems like if the appointments are from an hour to an hour and a half long, uh, that that keeps my day extremely extremely busy. And Retirement Boss Radio, I, 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 we joke about it, but you can't catch the plague through the radio mic. You just can't do it. And so it's been very lucrative, not just for me, but for other, some other folks that are also with Retirement Boss Radio. So, so this is a pretty quick webinar. So everybody that's on it today, I, I appreciate your time on a Tuesday. I don't know, but in, in Nebraska, it's supposed to be 60 degrees today. So if you're in the Midwest and some parts of the nation, it's pretty darn nice weather. Appreciate you being on the, 
on the uh, on the webinar. Um, become your a, a radio show host. That's different than putting ads for 30 seconds or 60 seconds on the radio. This is where you are a host, and you actually have a co-host from our production company. But you're you're talking for an hour, and it's an hour on uh, subjects that are uh, preset for you. Now you've got some variance and some leeway, you know, that where you can go with your own subjects. But we've got a track to follow that's been pretty successful. And I'll tell you right now, it's interesting about on radio and television. There's some star quality that happens to that versus seminar marketing. Now. I'm not against seminars. I do a lot of them, but I will say this: when you when you're on the radio, there seems to be some star quality that is attributed um, to you being there. Now, Steve, um, I don't know if you've given me the the um, the uh, controls yet, or I'm you want to do you this? controls, Dave? Once I give yeah, you controls, yeah. I'll never get them back. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a big control freak, but give them to me, Steve. No. <laughs> yeah, I will do that right now. Okay. As we're going through this today, certainly type in if you got any questions. We got enough people that it'd be a little bit chaos on the line itself. But but I will say this is that uh, radio marketing uh, it's hot right now, and a lot of people are listening to radio and podcasts in particular with the pandemic. Now get a load of those statistics. Radio reaches more Americans each week than your smartphone, than your personal computer, than your TV. Is that wild? I don't believe it, Dave. Yeah, I know. It's why I mean, it's hard for me to believe, but it, it's, it's absolutely the fact. The median age is 61. I work with the pre-retired or just retired. A lot of this is rollover money. The person yesterday, she was 57 years old with the one plus million. The person today that we got the third appointment with, of the, of the closing appointment, uh, is um, actually just sold a business, too. And he's 63 years of age. Median age of radio is about 61. Uh, radio reaches a more upscale listener. Get a load of this. 93% of adults in the 75,000 income households or more, that household averages 12 hours of listening to radio a week. It's a lot. And you hope one of those hours is retirement boss radio. And then solidifies you as an expert. It certainly does. And with branding, and, and talk radio, no doubt, is hot. And Steve, I'm going to have to have you go in and click those to go forward. I apologize, but for some reason, it just isn't working for me. Who's on radio? Well, people are on radio because they're making money. They're advertisers. They're making money. Rush Limbaugh, Glenn Beck, Kim Commando, Dave Ramsey. Those are national syndicate shows. They make their money from the advertisers that advertise on that show. But they're on this medium. Why? Because they're making money, um, they're 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 a bottom line type of firm, and I'll tell you right now, it isn't it isn't the average Joe that's on radio. One of the things about radio, I want to say this right now, when you're looking at costs, that's most people think it's extremely expensive. We've had all in costs. I mean, we're talking about which I'm going to talk here in a second. You know, the 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 radio the radio time. The production company, the, the the coaching on my part to coach you up on radio, get you comfortable with the script, et cetera, know what to expect. The call center, inbound call center, that's live. Even though this is a recorded show, you have a live inbound call center. We've had it as low as where everything in is $2,000, $2,500. More likely, it's probably in that thirty-five to 4500 range, and that's for four shows of an hour each. I mean, I'm averaging right now about 15 appointments per month from radio. I, I tell you, it, it keeps my – that in my seminars, it you know, keeps my calendar filled. Uh, just no doubt about it, okay? Dave, you might want to just take a minute, which I normally do, and kind of give folks a little background on your business as well here, where you, how you do your business and uh, kind of the mix of it and how long you've been doing radio and seminars. Yeah, yeah good point. Yeah, I've been in the business since 1981, and um, I do about 80% of my business with securities, fee-based and commission-based, and about maybe 20% of my business is with fixed indexed annuity and fixed, which I run through IAMS, 
and I coach for IMS. That's what I do. I mean, I'm a producer. I mean, I, I always, I always smile when I see someone saying, "Hey, I'm not producing any longer, but I'm a full time coach." That normally means they couldn't make it in production. <laughs> so I'm a I'm a producer, just like you are, pounding it every day, pounding that pavement every day. And but I coach also. I've coached for over 30 years, and I've got an exclusive relationship with IMS. They stipend me, so. I'm not in your hierarchy. I'm, I'm not in your override system. And they stipend me. And, and my goal is to go in and get more qualified appointments. Radio, I have done some type of radio for at least 30 years. I had my own show, Your Money Matters, was live at from 7.15 to 8 o'clock on Saturday morning for 11 years. Then I did a, um, uh, a market report that was recorded at the end of every market day. For a, it was about a five-minute market report. I did that for 14 years, and then retirement boss radio. It's been about almost two and a half years now. It's wild, Steve. Time flies, doesn't it? It really does. About two and a half years, and we rolled it out to the sales force, agent force, advisor force with IMS uh, a little over a year ago, maybe a year, a little over a year, a year and a half ago. And I'll tell you, it isn't for everybody. I mean, you have to be pretty quick on your feet. and You've got to know your subject matter. But but it's a great way to get in front of this pandemic has been extremely good. And there has been some loss of advertising revenue for those radio firms. And they're happy to have somebody on there, even at a reduced rate, which we've seen pretty competitive pricing right now. So that's how long I've been in. And, um, you know, if I can get 10 to 15 qualified appointments, uh, that's that's pretty darn good. And, and I've been averaging at least that, you know, per month. So what happens is, is with radio, and there's, there's really four parts, components, to kind of build this end result cake with, with, with Retirement Boss Radio. One of the more important people is you got to, here's what has to happen for you to be successful in this business. It's like real estate where they say location, location, location. Well, with, with radio, it's it's the right radio station at the right radio time at the right pricing. If you can find those three things, then you've got a winner. If if, if one of those is out of whack some, you, then your your odds go down for you to be successful. And we've had – I've had a few lately. We just could not get – we just couldn't find the right, the right station. We couldn't find the right time, or we found the right station in time, but the price was we thought was too high. So that's the three things how to really become successful at radio. And we're lucky because we got a media buyer, Jared, who's very very good at what he does. Over 23 years or 24 years in the industry, his family's been in the radio uh, station business for over 50 years. His grandpa was, his dad is. But about 23, four years ago, he broke off on his own as a media buyer. Very good at what he does. And he's out in a very, very good negotiator of pricing, of, of, of radio, of that hour radio show, time slot. Second thing then is we have a production company. Separate within the media buyer, I put this all together. Um, they They go and they produce the show. So we have a co-host from them. The show is an hour, but we only record for a half an hour. We repeat a second segment. Most people don't listen to, to, to a full hour of the show. They listen to bits and pieces, five minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. We have a very strong offer that, that there's four offers. Every 15 minutes, there's an offer. And we say the phone number, all, all of our phone numbers end in BOSS, BOSS, 29, uh, 2977. Like our number is 8- 888-975-2977, B-O-S-S, boss. Kind of catchy. People re re remember it. And they they edit it. They mix it. They get it to be in exactly an hour. They shoot it to the radio stations. Um, they've put all the advertisements in for you that have, you know, Dave Pimper with Retirement Boss Radio, Take Charge of Your Money. That uh, slogan, Retirement Boss Radio, Take Charge of Your Money, it is, I trademarked that before I did my very first show. That's how, that's how um, I was sure that it would be successful, which it has been, and it has been for quite a few of our 
of our agents and reps also. And then lastly, there's myself, who I coach you. I give you three coaching sessions. About 30% of our, of our calls come in about Social Security. So if you don't know Social Security, I coach you up three more sessions. That's all part of it. There's no co added cost. It's all part of the program itself. Some people know Social Security really well. If you're one of the 10, 15% of advisors that do, then we wouldn't have to go over social, but Social Security is important to know, and I'm here to answer any questions for you and help you along that, you know, with Retirement Boss Radio and that Social Security coaching, okay? So that's the four components of Retirement Boss Radio. Steve, we can go to the next slide. If you, there we go. It's a turnkey system, no doubt about it. Um, that turnkey system is pretty cool. When, you, when the call center, and it shows here, when the call center takes the live call, they write down the information. They, they, we're not mailing out information to them. I mean, we're setting the appointment. Whether it, in the state you're in, whether it be face-to-face, -face, which we do in Fremont or in, in Omaha also, or Zoom or on the telephone, we would rather have face-to-face, -face, but maybe with the lockdown, like if you're in Michigan, maybe that's tough to do right now. But but one of the three, the big thing is to be talking to a prospect, and then they give you a little bit of background about the caller and what they're interested in. Does it have star quality being your own radio host? You darn right it does. If you go to www.retirementbossradio.com, you will see and uh, really the layout of our operation. That's our website. You'll get to hear it. Uh, the actual broadcast themselves, the 30-minute broadcast themselves, the live ones, and you can kind of tell the quality that's involved, you know, of that website. So I just want to let you know that that www.retirementbossradio.com, you can certainly go on. Now, I talked about cost. You know, the average cost is from 2,500 to about 4,500. That's for a month of radio. That's that's all inclusive of the airtime of Retirement Boss Radio production. Of coaching, uh, which is which is stipend and paid for not by you but by by IMS to get you on the right track and keep you there, and then also with the call center, um, you are trained, you are coached up. Uh, it, I call it studio in a box. It's the only thing you really pay up front. You have to buy a professional microphone, headphones, and then a small sound box. It's about a foot and a half by a foot and a half. That's foam. And the whole thing costs about $225. I, I give you a link to Amazon, or you can buy where you want to, but most people just go to Amazon and buy that. But radio is complicated of how all the components work together. I try to make that easy to understand it. But it's the end result. It's like that. I was always amazed. I was a little kid watching my mom bake the cake. But you know what? The end result was pretty wonderful, and that's what we hope happens to yourself here. Al Jolston is an actor. He's, he's of course, Deceased now, he's an old actor in, in some of the talkies, but it says, I'd like to do radio just like pictures. Leave the imperfect stuff on the cutting room floor. Well, that You can do that here because it's edited out. Your mistakes are edited out. There's an old line that says, procrastination is my sin. It brings me constant sorrow. I really shouldn't practice it. Perhaps I'll stop. Well, you know what? Tomorrow never comes. If you heard something or saw something today, you said, I think I, I'd like to get more qualified appointments. I mean, if you're not investing in your practice, I'll tell you right now, it's probably not paying you back of what it should. Getting qualified appointments is key, especially key right now. Steve, I'm going to have you put up the, um, the poll. And this poll is if you'd like to go in and, and, get information that we discussed today on retirement boss radio or for that matter of fact on on seminar marketing i got another virtual seminar coming up here next week uh uh my last one i did it took us a while to understand it but we had 21 appointments i wrote i wrote three pieces of business so far from that one virtual seminar if you're not out marketing right now what a mistake most advisors they are bunkered on up you know they're in their home. I mean, almost all of the of the national and regional, which we're not, we're independent, but they're not working in the office. Um, um, they're not marketing, and there's lesser people marketing now than there ever has been. That's why I think we're getting such a great response. Don't let this opportunity. It's not going to stand, you know, be around forever. It might be three, four more months. What a great opportunity! 
to market your practice. But if you'd like to meet with me on the phone for 20, 25 minutes, discuss Retirement Boss Radio, if it's a possibility of marketing for you, uh, seminar marketing, whether it be virtual or face-to-face, if, you, if your state allows that, mark yes. If you mark no, that's fine. But if you mark yes, you know, we will go in. we got a lot of people with us today, so I would think we'd have a lot of appointments. We'd, I'd love to talk with you, give you some ideas about your practice. So Steve, I'll turn this over to you and see if there's any questions or comments that we need to, uh, we need to go over. Well, Dave, it's unusual. We don't have any questions actually typed in this morning. I haven't ever seen that before, I don't think. So <laughs> if we, it may be that we've got a technical issue there. If we do, I apologize uh, for that. I, I do know that as I look at the people voting, you've got a lot of happy voters here this morning, a lot of people that do want some yeah. information, whether it's on radio or one of your other marketing methods. And I would say that you know it's it's great to have uh, ideas on ways that you can build your business and to think about things. Uh, Dave's last slide, I can still see it. You can't because the poll's up, but it talks about procrastination. This is probably of all the times, uh, you know, where action is going to breed the best results for you. Uh, if you had to guess and say, okay, how long does it take me to get radio up and running? How long might it take me to get these digital seminars up and running? Dave can get you up and running here pretty quickly, and what a great way to start off the year uh, for 2021 with a whole new kind of approach to your business, whether it is radio or whether you do decide you want to do some uh, digital seminars or face-to-face -face seminars on Social Security. This is a really a great time to lay that foundation in place. Every year about this time, we offer to all of our sales group, everybody that, that works with us, the opportunity to, to do a marketing analysis and to look at your business closely and decide, hey, what, what do I want to do uh, different if I didn't get the results that I wanted last year uh, for, the, for the coming year? And so it's a good time to think about that. I would recommend and having... And, you know, Dave and I have been doing business and it really have had a personal uh, friendship and relationship now for 15, 14, 15 years. You know, I met Dave uh, at one of our academies that we did many, many years ago. Uh, and then later we uh, had opportunity to speak on uh, at some of our uh, top producers meetings going back 13, 14 years ago. And so, uh, you know, I consider Dave a personal friend. But beyond that, if you look at what Dave has accomplished with many of our producers over the years, whether it's been around seminars or been around practice management or now around radio or helping them understand social security, there's he is a wealth of great information for you. And so whether you want to chat with him about something specifically that we've talked about today, or whether you just want to spend some time with him and say, hey, this is where I'm at, and this is what I'm thinking, and how do you think that fits, or what do you, what? Because he's coached now, probably uh, very closely, probably in excess of 75 to 100 of our producers that do business with us regularly. And that being said, you know, there's the proof is in the pudding, and so he can help you uh, kind of get maybe have that preliminary conversation about what might work for you in 2021. Uh, if you weren't happy with 2020, and as I look at our sales results for the year, you know, I, th I think many of you probably could look at your, your business and say, I'm happy with what happened in 2020, given the pandemic. Our sales results as a, as a, a company here at IMS have been very good, actually, not up to last year's standards, but under the circumstances, really very good. So you might look at that and say, hey, once you get this pandemic behind us, I'm just going to rock and roll. And that may be the case, but maybe there's a way you can do it more efficiently with maybe less of your time or less of your money uh, or get better results, uh, you know, getting in front of a higher grade level of prospect. It's very real what Dave mentioned about the star power, the notoriety that's built when you're on the radio. And when I've talked to folks that have made the decision to get onto radio, almost every one of them is surprised by how easy it is and how good the, the show sounds. They're just surprised by that. I'm like, well, you know, everybody is, is going to sound like Dave. You know, you should go to Dave. Did you give them your uh, the the website so they could listen to a podcast? Did we give them that yet? I have, but I will do it again. It's www.retirementbossradio.com. Jump on that. I'll tell you what, it'll make a lot of sense to you if we're meeting on the phone and we're talking about Retirement Boss Radio. Once you read, kind of read through the website, you'll get a good feeling because this is kind of foreign to a lot of people. But my whole goal is let's get you comfortable with radio. We It, it, it sounds just like – let's wait till you listen to the to the – to the broadcast, it sounds just like you're in the studio with the co-host, 
and that's really cool. I mean, most people think it's live. Almost everyone thinks it's live. The right. call center is live. You know, that takes the appointment. So that's a it's a it's a pretty unique proposition. And again, if you've got enough appointments right now, hey, I certainly understand. More power to you. But if you don't, you should really consider radio and or seminar marketing because I think it could really up your practice. Yeah, we've seen the we've seen those results, and as I mentioned, that star power is is real. I, Dave, and I were out golfing, and many people recognize Dave on the radio. And I don't, you know, I think that's a good thing, Dave. Uh, generally, when, when people know what you do and how you do it, because I don't know if everybody that you see uh, necessarily knows that. And I think many of the people on our broadcast today may be thinking the same thing. You know, how can I get out into the into the world what I do and how I do it, so that when people maybe that I have a passing acquaintance with understand that might look my way. Cause there are a lot of people looking for guidance right now. And yep. radio is a great way for people to hear that and know what you do and, and kind of, you've got a, a excess of credibility built up because of, of the fact that you are on the radio. And when you listen to those broadcasts, that's what you're going to sound like. And Dave mentioned a little bit about, you know, what he provides, but having that script and, you know, it's not a scripted show. So it's not like you, you sit and read it. So your personality still comes through a little bit, but you've got all the show notes that you need to have good, solid subject matter and to kind of trade back and forth with that show co-host, Steve uh, is his name and do a great job and have something that sounds really good and something something that you can be proud of to have broadcast, you know, once a week for an hour. And as Dave mentioned, the, that call center is right there. So, you know, during the, during the course of the show, you know, Hey, let's, let's uh, take a minute here. And, and uh, if you want to, if you want more information on call such and such a number that rings right to the call center, and they're going to make you an appointment nine times out of 10, they're going to make you an appointment. So it's not just about building up your credibility or people knowing who you are. It's about getting, appointments that you're going to be able to see or talk to or zoom with uh, over the next two or three days. So a really, really solid way to meet people. So hopefully you'll take advantage of that. Uh, Dave, I don't see, uh, let me just double check. So it is unusual. We don't have any questions. So if we've had a problem and you were unable to get a question asked and answered on the system, by all means, set, a, set an appointment with Dave or just answer yes to that poll. We'll get you set up for a few minutes with Dave and we can get your questions answered of, uh, for you. So, um, with that, I think we're about done. Is there, is Dave, anything that you want to add as we as we close out here this morning? No, most of the people have stuck on the line with this. You know what? I mean, I mean, most people, especially when they start getting a little bit older, up in age, um, fifty plus. I mean, advisors kind of get set in on their ways. But I'll tell you right now, radio has a radio has an allure um, if you're a listener. I mean, I don't know if you ever called in on a radio show that was live. I mean, I have several times. Um, when I was a little kid, I called in Lyle Bremser and was was doing a show with someone. I called in and I got in. I was like 12 years old. I, I thought I was a star. I was on radio, you know. We'd, we'd love to talk to you, kind of give you some ideas of, of what's happening. I mean, realistically, what's happening out there as far as appointments and writing business but but we're in a unique time with this pandemic. You should put it to your advantage from a marketing standpoint. I hope I can talk to a lot of folks when we're done here. Yep. Yeah. It looks like most people want to chat with you. There's a couple that haven't voted. If Again, if there's a technical issue there, simply give me a call here at the office, 800-255-5055. I'll take a minute or two with you. I'll let Dave's team know that you want to chat with them, and I'll get that set up for you. No, no problem at all. Um, I did get one question across regarding is this available via recording. You'll all receive a link to this recording, and so you can listen to it again if there's something that you missed that you want to go over. Again, if that's the case, if there's something that you missed or something that you're unsure of, simply give us a call or set it, set it, put yes on that poll, and we'll get you in touch with Dave. That's the that's the quickest and easiest way to do it, and then we'll put you right on with the star of Retirement Boss Radio, Mr. Dave Pimper. <laughs> Thanks a lot. I hope hope I'm able to talk to a lot of folks, and, and everybody have just a great day. Have a good day, everybody. Thank you for your business. Okay. Bye-bye.